Howdy ho, neighborinos. We are here today for what was originally gonna be a different video, but now we're doing this instead because I was gonna do the uh, the finals of the PU League where I have the horses. However, honestly, dude, I don't fucking care enough to... The finals game, uh, I lost one over to CB Marcus, and it was like fucking 70 turns, man. And it, there was like a whole big part in there with stalling and shit, and it's just... I don't care enough to fucking live comm through like a 30 minute video, I mean post comm a 30 minute video of, you know, that shit, because it was just, it was not a very fun battle, however, CB did win, he deserved it, good game to him, he is the champion, my horses were not, you know, strong enough, so fuck it, um, you know, I think we did pretty good though for having fucking a team of horses, you know. But today we are here for PCP Season 6 Season Announcement. Oh my god, boys, it's all coming together. Basically, if you don't know, PCP is my personal league that I started with a bunch of real-life friends, like, years ago. And then it's kind of become like a whole little community in itself. The Pokemon community players, you know it's a community. And uh, we got a bunch of homies in here. And we are expanding this season to be a 16-team league, which is fucking ridiculous. And uh, it's just crazy to me, man, that like, you know that it's has come this far to where it's like eight friends or we're really seven friends within traveling distance of each other and then one buddy Andre you know who we would fucking draft uh, like on Skype so you know it, it was fun we took a lot of uh, inspiration from the league like the show of the league so we do have a last place trophy the Sacco and honestly that's where we gotta start with going into details about PCP because that's my favorite part man we don't have a first place trophy fuck a first place trophy if you win you get like uh, what is it called? Um, I have forgotten the name for it, but when you get to keep a Pokemon from your last team, basically, and then, you know, you get to keep it on your team, whatever that shit's called, I can't remember because I'm stupid in the brain, but long story short, PCP, it's going to be a fucking fun season, man. Uh, we got the Sacco, we got that last place trophy. Uh, it's in my storage unit, waiting and ready, bro. We are going to draft, so if today is Wednesday, we are drafting in one week and two days, basically, so like the next weekend, your boy's hype. So... Uh, we're gonna embrace the uh, the wackiness of early gen draft league. We're gonna do free draft, and we are going to do um, Galar only mons. So only the Galar decks at first. However, the twist is going to be because like that was the whole big thing is like we don't know do we allow all the mons? Do we allow just the Galar mons? What what do we do? What we're gonna do is start with the Galar mons, do free draft, and then halfway or so through the season. We're going to let people redraft. You can keep, like, we haven't quite ironed out the exact details of it. We'll see kind of how everything lines up. But um, you'll get to keep, like, I'll say fucking probably three or four. It'll be 11 mons. So, yeah, you probably get to keep three or four of your mons. And then you redraft, and the whole dex is there. So it will no longer be free draft. So the things you have then, you know, will the point totals will come to you and shit. But that gives us time to get things tiered out. It gives us thing it gives us time to kind of enjoy and appreciate just the galarmons but also if we hate just doing galarmons only then it's not like you're committed to that you know so this will be kind of a tester season you get to see are we going to enjoy just the limited dex mons are we going to enjoy using everything and all this new broken shit that's coming out i won't spoil you if you um if you don't want to be spoiled just yet because then the game comes out in two days so if like you made it this far without being spoiled i won't be the one to spoil you so therefore i won't show you the document because it has all the new ones on there already and shit so um, without further ado, let's go through these coaches, baby. Number one, you already know, baby. Number one in your hearts, number one in the league, except I didn't. I haven't won in like two seasons, so not really. It's me. It's your boy, Shayquaza. And uh, <laughs> I don't know what else to tell you about me, because if you watch this channel, you probably already know more about me than you ever wanted to in your entire life, dude. Like, you watch two story times, and you're like, this guy's fucking stupid. I don't want to, like... The fact that people keep subscribing to this channel fucking baffles me because like what do I even talk about you know like what? I'm not good at the game like I guess I'm funny but that's really all I got going so like you guys must really like humor huh anyways coach number two back after a long hiatus away from the league our boy Javi aka sweet potato 69242109696929420 whatever he's got a long ass like digits after his name we always give him shit for it. but it's my boy hobby he was there og from season one um whenever i first started playing pokemon hobby was the best player i knew so like in like gen gen 6 like x and y type shit i used to try my hardest to beat this dude to pokemon and i never could it was fucking ridiculous and now the tables have turned you know so he's coming back <clears throat> we're excited to have him back he's like he's like the father figure of the league you know he's dies actual father so he's like you know 
Just dies dead. But um, it's my boy, dude. He's one of my best friends in real life, and I fucking love the dude. So happy to have him in the league again after a hiatus. And uh, we he made me not tell anyone, uh, even though I did tell Pat that he was coming back. So we just now announced that I think last week or so. So everybody was hyped to have him back. It's gonna be lit. Next, number three. Coach number three, we have Andre, a.k.a. Andrew. Oh, also, I'm the Dallas Starmies. Javi is the Houston Team Rockets. And Andre is the um, Evansville Osho Waters, I believe, still, I think. His logo will be on the screen. Everybody's logo should be on the screen. And if they're not on the screen, I'm sorry because I'm stupid. Because also, I got to make one of these logos still, so I doubt I'll have it done in time for the, the fucking thing. But, yeah. Um, Andre is a good pal of mine. He is the kind of the reason this league got started. Uh... We would, we would talk a lot. We actually met on Instagram because of a mutual friend. So, like, he followed uh, one of my friends, Shannon, the person, actually the person who made the Tangela costume for me. So, uh, I would always see him commenting on her shit, and then we ended up talking in her comment section, and then we became friends, and we started a league. And then, next thing you know, two years ago, we fucking met up and all went to Tennessee and got drunk together. And it was a good old time, you know? So, Andre is, uh, Andre's a good pal. He's, um... He definitely has, like, the heart for the game. You know, this dude loves Pokemon. This dude has multiple Pokemon tattoos. Like, you won't come across many people that love Pokemon more than Andre does. Uh, I know he's a shiny hunter as well, so shout out to them shiny hunters. But he's been the boy. He's only me and him and the next coach I'll announce have been in this league every season. So shout out to Andre for holding it down. He's got that coveted uh, PCP Season 1 uh, OG role in the PCP Discord, which if you want to join the PCP Discord will be in the description, probably. Probably? We'll see. <laughs> but yeah, man. So, next, Coach 4. We got Dan and his team name, which may change, but for now it is the Dallas Stallers. I know, it's kind of close to the Starmies, huh? But he is our resident stall man. Everyone hates playing Dan, but Dan's a good guy. You know, I, I fucking like Dan, but hate his playstyle. Thank God his Signature Mon isn't in the decks, and I'll, I'll word it vague like that because you probably don't know what a Signature Mon is, so you're not spoiled yet. That didn't count. <laughs> but uh, Dan is a very good player. He knows how to use stall, and then he can... The thing the thing with Dan is he knows how to use his stall very well, but then also he can bring, like, two stall Mons and then have an offensive-ass team, and he can still set up and sweep your ass, and you're going to have a bad time, dude. You're going to have a shit dick time. So, uh, Dan is a good player, and like I said, he, only me and him and Andre have been in this league every season, and uh, we're happy to have him. I fucking like Dan. I always see him. I'll see him occasionally at parties and shit, and we're always like, yo, so let's fucking talk Pokemon for a sec, you know? <laughs> then next we have the boy, the homie, the current champion of the PCP, uh, Pat and his Sin Sydney Thunderous. I said Sydney, but um, yeah, dude, the buddy Cal Pat. Pat is one of, if not the best friend that I fucking have like in this community. So like, fucking shout out to him. He's like the best front office member you could ever have, really. Except for sometimes he isn't. Because, like, you can see the screenshot. You can fucking, you know. <laughs> but, um, yeah, dude. Pat's, like I said, the current champion. He won the last two seasons. I won the first three seasons. So he's not allowed to win one more season. Because then we're both going to have three wins. And, like, I can't, you know, my, my pride will not allow that. So we can't let... That's going to be the, the theme for this season is don't let Pat win, you know. So, good player. Good builder. Good fucking drafter. Hates shitty speed tiers. You guys know Pat. If you've been on the channel, you fucking know him. Honestly, you probably know him almost as good as you know me after all these years. So, fucking shout outs to him and uh, his Sydney Thunderous. Now, next, we have uh, basically Pat Jr. You know, we got Chris Doomshroom. Uh, they used to have a channel together. Then uh, Chris, you know, got busy with real life shit, so he could no longer do the channel. So, Cal Pat and Doomshroom became Cal Pat and. and um, Chris's team name in this server only is two Sydney, two Thunderous. So, it's like, Pat's got Fast and the Furious, you got fucking two Fast, two Furious, you know, so you got fucking, uh, yeah, you got Sydney Thunderous, you got two Sydney, two Thunderous, which is hilarious, and, you know, you see the logo, it's real, it's definitely pretty up there, you know. But, Chris is a good dude, he, uh, me, him, uh, the homie Nathan, Jew, um, Andre, me, Chris, Pat, Andre, Jew, yeah, we all went and met up at uh, 
in um in Tennessee, and we all got really drunk and had a grand old time. And Andre had a pillow that was hard as a fucking rock, which was hilarious. But um yeah, dude, he fucking Chris and Pat came and kicked out of my house for like two weeks. We fucking got to know each other in real life. So you know, you got your fucking online friends, you got your real life friends. Well, we got fucking both, bitch. You know, Chris once again, um he's a good battler for sure, but um. Lately, I think he's been doing this more for fun. Obviously, he hasn't been uploading content anymore, you know, so he doesn't, like, you know, he doesn't have that drive to uh, to try quite as hard as most people do. And even then, this is the PCP. It's for, it's mostly for funsies, dude, so, like, fuck it, you know? But uh, if there's one man that knows a fucking, that knows his way around a wacky build and a wacky draft, it's fucking Chris. I always look forward to playing and being in leagues with that dude just because he's fun to be around. So everybody, everybody loves Chris, you know? <laughs> Next, we have another dude that's been around here for a while. I think he missed out on last season because of clout, but um, he's back because his dad is back. We have our boy Die, Jason Diet Tight, the homie, and uh, the reigning, uh, the reigning PCL champion. You know, Die and that Reggie Ram kicking that ass. But um, yeah, man, Die's my fucking boy. Um, Die got us into APA, which was nice of him. And, uh, he's, dude, guys, you guys know him. You know, he's America's favorite 14-year-old, basically. So, um, he's also king of the puppers, I believe, is what he's, uh, what he's been recently. So, um, you all know Die, dude. And you fucking, you've seen him on the channel many a time. <laughs> We've played him in several draft leagues many a time. Good player, good builder. Um, best Minecraft YouTuber this side of the Mississippi, I think, is really all we gotta say there, but that's the homie die. You guys know he's back because Javi's back, so, um, yeah, man, we're happy to have him back, basically. Long, long story short, happy to have that man back. Next, we'll get into some of the homies that, um, have come over from the PRS series, the, uh, basically the league that I have all the horses in. That's a whole series of things. It's always, like, a league going on, so from there, we have Iron Shadow, the homie. He's been in a couple videos on the channel as well. If you're in the PCP server, you'll always see him up in that bitch. And uh, he's a dude that's basically always making playoffs, always fucking building good teams, and always having a good time doing it too. Just a fucking, just an all-around good guy. We all fucking love Iron, dude. Uh, he'll go on like hiatus every now and then, and when he's gone, we always miss him, you know? So, as always, happy to have him back in the league. Happy to be able to battle him again. We always have some good fucking battles too, dude. I never like, I never battle Iron, and I'm like, fuck, I gotta do this shit again. It's always like, ooh, we get to battle Iron Shadow, you know? So, um... Good homie, good Pokemon player, and we're like, that's, is this just gonna be me saying we're having him in the league every time? But we are, dude. These are like some of my favorite people on the fucking internet, so I'm happy we have them all in one place to be able to, uh, to fight, you know, in BCP. Also, it's super funny explaining to people what my league is the first time, because they're like, you're doing PCP? And I'm like, no, like, it's the, it's called the Pokemon Community Players, it's not like the drug, I'm not, yeah, fuck it, I'm doing PCP, dude, but it's like not worth explaining anymore, fuck it. <laughs> <clears throat> so, next, we have CB Marcus, a.k.a. the dude I just lost that finals game to, and uh, obviously he's a good player if he fucking beat my beat me and my horses, you know, in my, my element, you know, but good dude, good builder, he was one of the, uh, good builder and player, um, he was one of the, the captains in the PCP team tourney we did, so, you know, um, just all around good dude, man, you know, once again, we're happy to have him in the league, and, uh, you know, it's cool. Him and uh, Iron Shadow and this next coach came together from PRS because it was like you know we needed to uh, we needed to fill some ranks over here and uh, nobody better to do it than these three guys you know so next we have Kip up the boy and uh, fucking uh, and his Orlando Magic Carps also CB Marcus is the Rose City Roselias I believe and I can't remember Iron Shadow's team but you all you all saw Dai's team he's the New Britain Rock Ruff I believe still. But, uh, Kip Up's logo was cool. <laughs> um, Kip Up, also super good dude. He was one of the first people I battled in PRS that, like, beat me and beat me, like, bad to where I had to, like, reevaluate my entire life. Like, I was like, oh, fuck, I thought these were just gonna be easy dubs, dude. I didn't know, like, I didn't know we were gonna have to, like, fucking, you know, like, bust out the, the notepad and fucking, like, you know, learn things and stuff. And nobody wants to learn things and stuff, dude. But, Kip up, I believe he actually still streams on Twitch occasionally, if not more than occasionally. Uh, he has a channel as well, but I don't think he uses that as much. But we definitely still see him streaming. I'll pop in his stream every now and then. Um, good dude, good builder, and <laughs> we're happy to have him in the league. So, you know, you know how it be. Uh, next, 
we have our boy Tony, aka March Hair Twenty Six, or whatever the fuck his number is. Um, do you remember him if you were in the uh, the back in the in the back in the day when we used to hang out in Austin's Discord server all the time, the the um, Dragon's Den? Tony was always back there. You know, we would always be building, always be chilling, always be playing. Uh, he's been in many, uh, I think he's been in a couple videos on my channel, but definitely been in a lot of videos on like JB's and Austin's channel. So, um, good homie. Another dude that he's kind of been out of the game for a little while. He's kind of in the same boat as Hobby. He's been out of the game for a little while, but he's back and he's back to come. Kick it with the homies. Have some fun. Dick around. Maybe get a Sacco. We don't know. He said he wanted the Sacco. Nobody wants the Sacco, dude, but he said he wants it. So if you want the fucking balls, dude, they're yours, you know? <laughs> if you want the balls, dude, they're yours. And if you want them, like, they don't have to be blue by the time you get them. You know, you can get them while they're still fresh and gold, you know? So, um, California Kinglers, I believe, is his team name. So, um, oh, I guess I should have mentioned. This starts the, uh, the next few are going to be, like, newer editions, I guess. But people that have been around but have joined relatively recently um then we got word life you guys know word he's been i think he's been on the channel a couple times he's been supposed to start a channel for a hot minute too uh, you got his logo on the screen i ain't saying that shit i'll tell you that right now i'm not fucking saying that shit but good dude um well i mean good might be good might be sugarcoating it but <laughs> uh no i'm just kidding fucking we love word life dude He's fucking, uh, he's known as Twunt Life in the server, though, because, you know, ha, but, uh, but no, dude, he's a really good battler. Honestly, every time I gotta battle this man, it's like, fuck, you know, it's like, well, now we gotta try. So, um, good to have him in the league, you know, uh, he disappeared for a little while, so we didn't, we actually weren't gonna include him in this season because we weren't, we just, you know, dude disappeared for, like, months, so we weren't sure if he was ever coming back, but he came back about two weeks ago and, uh, was like, Oh, I guess I'm not in the league anymore. So we were like, oh, you know, well, if we get to 16, then, you know, you can join. He was like, eh, I don't really care. But then him and uh, the next coach actually decided they wanted to join. The next coach is going to be Bredibus. You might remember, I believe we played him in the HBA. You guys remember the fucking HBA, that fucking shithole of a league from back in the day? Um, that league was a lot of fun, but it was a shit show. And it was particularly a shit show because the person that ran it, always comments and trolls me on Twitter and YouTube. Fuck that guy, you know? <laughs> oh, man. Uh, Shout-outs to Evader. But no, um, fucking uh, Brett's a good player. He also participated in that PCP team tourney. We're happy to have him back as an official member of the team. And uh, if you join PCP server, you can actually find some pictures of him in real life, dude. This boy's cute as shit, dude. Have you fucking... You know, come through and check him out. You know, maybe you can, you know, shoot your shot. Who knows? <laughs> oh man um then next uh we got three brand newcomers we have uh I, I was gonna say we have pat's buddy but he's all our buddy now we got sky horse tamer um i forget exactly where i know him from oh because um in uh in league war tournament yeah in lwt uh he was with uh he was with pat and uh, elliot and all them and chris of course on the Aussie team, I didn't get accepted to join in the Texas team or the Southern team or whatever, so I just hung out with them, helped them build, prep a little bit, you know, did all that fun stuff, but um, he's a good dude, and also, I knew for sure he would fit in here because we fucking one of the first things we talked about was the show with the league, so I was like, dude, we have a Sacco, like holy shit, you know, so fucking uh, Sky is also, from what I've seen, he's a very good battler, so not looking forward to having to try again, you know, I'm trying to get these easy dubs, dude, fuck, <laughs> um, but no, we're, we're, we're glad to have him on board and looking forward to it, I've never played him myself, but looking forward to being able to battle this dude. And, uh, yeah, man, you know, another, an, add another Aussie to the list. You can't ever have too many, dude. Even though they're always asleep when you want to battle, like, <laughs> um, it's always good to have some more Aussies in here. So that's three we have total. Also, um, I forgot words in Brett's fucking team, but oh well. So, um, Sky, his, since, you know, he's an Australian as well, and he's also in Sydney, I guess that's like the pun is to do Sydney Thunderous. So he's the third Sydney Thunderous team. Therefore, uh, he's going to be Sydney Thunder's Tokyo Drift. This is the thumb. I gotta, I gotta make this logo. I'll probably do that this weekend. But um, so you won't see one on the screen right now. But just know I'm, I'm working, dude. I'm over here in Photoshop immediately making this fucking Sydney Thunder's Fast and the Furious, uh, 
Tokyo Drift, basically, logo, and it's going to be hilarious. I'm looking forward to it. So, shout to Sky. Good to have him in here. And second to last, we have a dude that uh, that I met on Twitter, basically. Um, we kind of bonded over some weeb shit. We talked about some Hunter x Hunter bullshit, and then uh, we kind of just been talking ever since. The boy, uh, Monster, you can find him... Uh, You'll see his logo on the screen, obviously. You can find him in the servers. Yeah, I, just, I don't know why the fuck I just said that. You can find everyone here in the server, dude, because that's where we have to be, you know? But, um, good pal. Fucking good dude. Uh, happy to have him in the league, as we've said 15 times now. Jesus fuck, Shaden, come on. <laughs> but, um, yeah, man, good dude. Happy to have him in here. I said it again. After I made fun of myself for saying it too many times, I said it again. What is wrong with me? Fuck. But, um, yeah, see... We were going to have him in as a replacement, just because I know life can get hectic, especially since we have uh, several dads in the server, like lit actual like people with children, not just like, hey dad, you know, but uh, yeah, so I wanted to have some backups, however, um, we ended up needing to go from to 16, so with uh, with Brett and Word, we ended up at 14, so I was like, well that makes 15, so that just means we need one more person, and that person we decided to get was going to be Galadite, the fucking homie, the dude, the fucking, you know, in the Paramore gang, you know, the homie, the dude I played in uh, ABC in the regular season, and we also squared off again in the finals of the ABC, where I haxed him, you know? So, I'm sure he'll be here looking for his revenge, and we're fully expecting, you know, to just embrace the madness of this whole shit show that is early gen draft league. I'm looking forward to it. I hope we get to play again. Um, everything's going to be randomized, like the, the fucking, uh, what's it called? Like the schedule and the uh, divisions and whatnot, but I hope we end up, if not in the same division, I hope we end up at least getting to battle each other because uh, we do need a bit of a rematch because the first two games we had have been a little a little on the fucky side of things, you know? So, that is going to be our 16. You can see his fucking, uh, I believe he's the north side Neuverns. Yeah. So, you can see, every, you, you fucking, you know, you saw everyone's logos probably. Um, honestly, I might just not put people's logos. I have to put people's logos in. What am I talking about? But, um yeah man that's the 16 that's the full squad however if you made it this far and you do want to be a replacement for this league uh there is a decent chance if, if there's 16 people in a league dude there's a decent chance one of them's not going to make it all the way through the league you know so if you want to be a replacement hit me up on twitter hit me up on discord whatever let someone know and uh we'll get you in this bitch and uh yeah man that's gonna do it i didn't expect this to be a 22 minute video so i'll go ahead and end it there like subscribe do all that bullshit and we will see you guys uh like next week really with uh, with a draft and L. so yeah man appreciate you bye forever